So how many grams do 20 calcium atoms weigh? Okay. So 20 calcium. How many grams do they weigh? So let's write down what the problem says. So we've got calcium and we've got 20 atoms. So, what do we know about one atom of calcium and how much it weighs? So, we look up at the periodic table, right, and we've got a conversion, right? One atom of calcium equals 40.08, we'll say, AMU, right? So, put it okay with that? And we already know this other conversion vector that was given to us, 1 AMU to grams, right? So we should be able to put these two in a row to get this mass. Is everybody okay with that? So it gave us, the problem gave us the number of calcium atoms, right? So we'll say 20 calcium so again, it's good for you to, you know, if you're having trouble with what units go on the bottom, go on the top, write the whole thing out like this. So, oh, the problem, sorry, the problem gave us, um, when it's 20 like this, right, I should have said something, that's an infinite number of significant figures, okay? Because it's just like counting. How many students do I have in this room? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Not 8.3 something, okay? So that's an infinite number of significant figures. So in actuality, this problem, you can give it to as many significant figures as you want, the final answer, if that makes sense, okay? Uh, it's common to go, go to like three or four significant figures, if that's the case. So anyways, so do we have a conversion that goes from atoms to AMU? Yes. So one atom of calcium is 40.08 AMU, or one calcium atom. And then, of course, we do the conversion vector that we used in the problem previous, and say one AMU at the bottom, 1.661 times 10 to the negative 24th grams on the top. So we, will we expect this to be a lot of grams or a tiny amount of grams? Small amount, right? A small amount. Because four calcium atoms, very tiny, right? Very tiny. Or 20 calcium atoms, very tiny. Four is also very tiny. Okay, so let's just plug in, right? So 20 times 40.08 times And so this one you would expect to get a negative exponent, hopefully, right? So again, I'm going to take this to four sig figs just because. Uh, 1.331 times 10 the negative 20 first grams. Okay, so that's how many grams 20 calcium atoms weighs. Hopefully it makes sense, right? Because that's very much smaller than one gram. Okay. 